హాయ్ ఫ్రెండ్స్ వెల్కమ్ టు మ్యాథ్స్ విత్ మనీ సో ఈరోజు ఈ వీడియోలో మనం ఎస్ఎస్సి సిజిఎల్ టూ థౌజండ్ ట్వంటీ వన్ రిజల్ట్ గురించి మనం డిస్కస్ చేస్తాం సో ఈరోజే ఎస్ఎస్సి సిజిఎల్ ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ వన్ రిజల్ట్ అనేది వచ్చింది సో ఈ ఎగ్జామ్ ఆల్రెడీ మనకి ఏప్రిల్లో జరిగింది సో డిక్లరేషన్ ఆఫ్ రిజల్ట్ ఆఫ్ కంబైన్డ్ గ్రాడ్యుయేట్ లెవెల్ ఎగ్జామినేషన్ టైర్ వన్ టూ థౌజండ్ ట్వంటీ వన్ సో మనకి రిటర్న్ అప్లో ఇచ్చిన నోటీస్ అనమాట ఇది ఎస్ఎస్సి కండక్టెడ్ ద సిజిఎల్ ఎగ్జామ్ ట్వంటీ ట్వంటీ వన్ ఫ్రమ్ లెవెంత్ ఏప్రిల్ టు ట్వంటీ ఫస్ట్ ఏప్రిల్ ఇన్ ద సిబిటి సో కంప్యూటర్ బేస్డ్ మోడ్లో పెట్టడం జరిగింది ఆన్లైన్ మోడ్ సో బేస్డ్ ఆన్ ద మార్క్స్ కోడ్ ఇన్ ద టైర్ వన్ ఎగ్జామినేషన్ క్యాండిడేట్స్ హ్యావ్ బీన్ షార్ట్ లీస్ ద కేటగిరీ వైజ్ టు అపీర్ ఇన్ టైర్ టూ అండ్ టైర్ త్రీ ఎగ్జామినేషన్స్ సెపరేట్ కట్ ఆఫ్స్ హ్యావ్ బీన్ ఫిక్స్డ్ ఫర్ ద పోస్ట్ ఆఫ్ అసిస్టెంట్ ఆడిట్ ఆఫీసర్ అండ్ అసిస్టెంట్ అకౌంట్స్ ఆఫీసర్ దట్ ఈస్ అ లిస్ట్ వన్ and junior statistical officer that is jso list 2 and statistical investigator grade 2 list 3 and all other posts list 4 many of the candidates as in dilemma that if i am in the list 1 which post i am eligible or if i am in the list 4 for which post i am eligible so there is a confusion there is a dilemma for the first time appearing candidates that's why i am telling you in detail uh, if you clear or if you are in the list 2 for which post you are eligible if your name is in the list 4 for which jobs or which post you are eligible or which papers you can write in tier 2 that i will discuss in detail let's see basically in the list 1 observe this candidate shortlisted in tier 1 for appearing in tier 2 that is paper 1 paper 2 and paper 4 in the paper 4 that is general studies finance and accounts and a tire 3 for the post of assistant audit officer and assistant accounts officer so if you are in the list one if you are in the list one then you are eligible you are eligible in the tire 2 we have how many papers in ssc cgl paper 1 paper 2 and paper 3 and paper 4 there are four papers so if you are in any list if you are any list then definitely you are eligible to write paper 1 and paper 2 paper 1 means quantitative abilities and paper 2 means english if you are in any list then you are definitely eligible for these two papers if you are in list 1 then you are eligible for paper 4 this is finance and accounts finance and accounts so if you write this paper 4 and you got good marks then you are eligible for two posts inclusive of all other posts that is income tax inspector ministry of external affairs and the assistant section officer all these posts and also you are allotted to other two posts what are those posts assistant audit officer and assistant accounts officer for these two posts are also you are eligible if you are in list one okay and of course if you are in any list definitely you are automatically eligible for a type 3 not only for type 2 you are eligible for type 3 okay i hope all of you clear since the list one candidates are eligible for in the type 2 paper 1 paper 2 and paper 4 and also type 3 and the cutoff for list one candidates is very much higher compared to other lists so for sc candidates it is 136.7 and for st 131.6 and for obc it is 153.3 and for ews 156.8 and for ur candidates 159.07 and for oh and hh candidates 124 and 101 respectively and for others persons with disabilities it is 65.2 so for list one the total candidates available are 10971 okay now coming to the list 2 list 2 means candidates shortlisted in tier 1 for appearing in tier 2 that is paper 1 paper 2 of course and paper 3 paper 3 we have statistics paper we have statistics paper and tier 3 for the post of junior statistical officer okay if you see the list 3 candidates there is a paper 3 uh, same list 2 and list 3 candidates are similar 
because these two list candidates are eligible for the paper 3 in tier 2 there is a paper 3 that is related to statistics okay that means if you are allotted or if you are in uh, in the list 2 or list 3 then you are eligible to write a paper 1 paper 2 and paper 3 of tier 2 and tier 3 exam sir then why they gave two lists because if you are in list 2 then you are eligible for the post of junior statistical officer what is that job junior statistical officer that is jso for suppose if you are in list 3 then you are eligible for the statistical investigator grade 2 okay for these two posts there are different different cutoffs for list 2 somewhat higher compared to list 4 and somewhat lower cutoff than the list 1 for sc 139.09 for st 125.58 and for OBC 162.4 and for EWS 162.4 and for UR 162.4 and these are very very higher uh, marks compared to list 1 if you observe list 1 they are uh, sorry list 1 candidates uh, list 2 candidates are more has more cutoff than the list 1 this is the highest cutoff okay and there are no OH, RHH and other PWD candidates in junior statistical officer and the total candidates eligible are 3536 okay and there is a special uh, eligibility criteria if you want uh, to write the junior statistical officer definitely you have the statistics in your degree level okay then only you can write this paper and similarly for list 3 this is the least cutoff uh, these uh, these candidates has very very least cut off than all the three lists. Okay, for SC seventy five point seven, ST sixty two point seven, and for OBC for EW, if you are if you see all these cut offs, definitely these are very much lesser cut offs than other lists. Okay, next list four. These are the candidates who are appearing. SSC CGL to get their dream post to get their dream post like uh, income tax inspector like uh, sorry like income tax inspector or customs inspector like that is PO preventive officer or examiner or ministry of external affairs or excise inspector or uh, in, uh, assistant enforcement officer in ED enforcement directorate or ASO assistant section officer in other ministries okay these are the most important uh, jobs in ssc cgl if you want to crack these jobs then minimum of minimum you have to be in the list 4 list 4 you are in the list 4 then definitely then definitely you are eligible for paper 1 and paper 2 only for paper 1 and paper 2 in tier 2 and tier 3 exams okay not for paper 3 and paper 4 and if you observe the cutoffs these are the main cutoffs for ssc ccl tier 1 for sc it is 94.5 and for st 81.5 for obc 117.87 for ews for 109.64 and for general candidates it is 130 so this is the cutoff for ssc ccl for general candidates Similarly, you can uh, read other cutoffs also, other category cutoffs also. Now, observe the candidates. These are the candidates who are appearing tier 2. How many candidates? 1,13,848. Okay. So, if you are in list 4, if you are in list 4, then it is need not or it is not necessary to be you are in the other list. But if you are in list 1, but if you are in list 1, definitely you are in list 4. If you are in list 2, then definitely you are in list 4. Okay. But if you are in list 3, you may or may not be in list 4. Okay. Is it clear all of you? Okay. Now, these are the cutoffs for each list and uh, eligibility for each list I already told you. Okay. Now, in the notice, there is one more thing he was given. 
the final answer piece along with the question papers will be published on the website of the commission on july 12th for a period of one month for a period of one month the final keys will be there in the commission website that is ssc.nic.in and it is available from july 12th onwards and one more thing he told that is the marks marks of the qualified candidates and also non qualified candidates will be in the website on july 12th and you can download or you can check the check your individual marks from july 12th to august 1st by logging to the registered id and also password okay individual scores you can check from july 12th to august 1st so based on the marks you can gear up your preparation for ssc cgl type 2 okay and also he given the dates for a type 2 exam so type 2 exam will be conducted on 8th and 10th august 2022 it is not from 8 to 10th it is on 8th and on 10th so i hope there will be no normalization for type 2 exam okay and type 3 exam will be on august 21st okay nearly 2 weeks after this 21st there will be uh, type 3 for all the candidates who uh, are in these lists and uh, it is also these dates are also subjected to the prevailing conditions and government guidelines issued from time to time in view of handling of the covid-19 pandemic so if the pandemic is like this only then you will have the uh, same dates but if the pandemic is uh, not in our control then dates will be changed okay so this is regarding the result of 2021 cgl now if you are in any of the list how to prepare type 2 i hope all of you candidates who are watching this video already prepared already preparing the type 2 exam yes or no already you wrote many mock tests also i know if you are willing to get the job definitely you have that determination so definitely you will already in track okay but my suggestion is basically those who are getting the low marks are because of mostly because of advanced maths most of the candidates who are preparing in ssc cgl they will get less marks in advanced maths topics only not in uh, arithmetic topics arithmetic topics like uh, time and distance time and work uh, a percentage is average they will they are very good at those topics but while coming to advanced maths topics like algebra geometry and 2d mensuration 3d mensuration trigonometry coordinate geometry progressions in these topics they are getting uh, less marks and they are very matlab uh, they are they don't have how to solve the a uh, problem in less time they don't know the tricks in advanced maths because advanced maths it is full of formulas it is full of concept so how to learn that concept so I, in my channel i already told each and every advanced maths topics except progression progression is very less weighted topic you may get one or two questions mostly one or nil questions in tier 2 so remaining topics i already completed i already completed in my channel and except these three courses what are those courses circles and 3d mensuration and coordinate geometry except these three topics remaining topics are free of nature so you can watch freely at any time this is a pdf i if you want any of you want this pdf with single page you can ask me at any time uh, and you can message me at any time to get this pdf uh, uh, through whatsapp uh, below uh, the number which is scrolling down now uh, you can uh, whatsapp me to that number that to or uh, want this pdf this is a pdf with the topic and link in this call so if you open this pdf in the adobe adobe pdf format adobe 
play, play store, uh, Adobe app. Then if you click this link, then it will go directly to the algebra playlist. If you click the link trigonometry link here, then it can directly go to the trigonometry playlist. Okay, and uh, you can I already explained the CGL previous questions and also CHSL previous questions also. One more thing that is most important: the uh, pure maths formula revision. I explained many formulas that to pure maths from basics to advanced level formulas. So after your preparation over, please watch these videos by clicking here. Then you will go to that uh, playlist. There are 10 plus hours of only formula revision videos on the topics algebra, trigonometry, geometry and 2D mensuration, 3D mensuration, coordinate geometry and also inscribing figure. For all these topics, just revising the formulas only took me to 10 plus hours. If you revise these uh, formulas, that means if you apply or if you give your 10 plus hours of you, then you will get easily score 100 plus marks out of 200, 100 plus marks will be, you can get it. Okay, I explained all these uh, formulas in uh, videos. If you revise, if you want to revise, then these videos are sufficient. Okay, these videos I explained in 2019 CGL, but same formulas are also useful for CGL 2021 also. So that's why uh, please watch these videos also. If anyone want the course like circles and 3D mensuration or coordinate geometry, you can message me through WhatsApp. And in all these paid courses, I explained clearly each and every topic with practice problems. And also 2011 to 2018 SSC CGL means questions are also explained topic wise also. Okay, so please take that course also which will be very very useful to get the good marks. Okay, next thing how to prepare arithmetic. For arithmetic, I want to tell you only one book, only one book that is a Rakesh Yadav sir book. I hope all of you know the Rakesh Yadav sir. Regarding arithmetic, this book is written notes is a very very nice book that is sufficient if you want to prepare uh, any other book, don't read any other book, prepare this book only 2 to 3 times or 5 times, any times, but this book is sufficient. And for English, I prepared Neetu ma'am, Neetu uh, Singh, Neetu Singh ma'am, that is a KD campus, KD campus book, volume 1 and volume 2, those two are sufficient. And if you want to prepare previous questions, then black book, black book by QMats, black book for English, that is also sufficient. These books are sufficient and no other book is not at all required. For advanced maths, my channel videos and for arithmetic Rakesh Yadav, for English, KD campus and black book. And practice more number of mock tests from any source. Any coaching institute, irrespective of coaching institute, you can take or you can write more number of mock tests as much as possible. Okay, and I have so much of experience on this SSC CGL. In SSC 2017, I was selected as examiner, and in 2018, I was selected as a preventive officer with the rank of 720 All India rank. So I know how SSC will ask the questions. With my experience, I consolidated all the topics regarding concept or regarding practice problems. You can watch the videos. You can understand how the depth of the concept uh, SSC was asking. Okay, you will definitely love the, love all the courses. You can enjoy the courses. Okay, so with this you can prepare. Then you will get the more marks. If you have any doubts or any queries or any suggestions regarding SSC gel preparation, you can WhatsApp me at any time to the number which was scrolling down. With this, I will conclude this session. I am wishing you very, very all the best and congratulations to the selected candidates of SSC gel tier 1. Thank you very much. Jai Hind.